the unmanned systems force has acquired the status of a separate branch of the armed forces of Ukraine, along with the special operations, territorial defense, logistics, support and medical forces. On February 6, 2024, the Ukrainian president instructed the government and the Ukrainian armed forces general staff to develop proposals for the creation of a new type of force. And on June 11, they were presented by the Ministry of Defense of Ukraine. For the Ukrainian army, drones are of particular value. Kyiv plans to buy about one and a half million drones in 2024, the Ministry of Strategic Industries has said. We are now capable of producing three million. As of today, about one and a half million have been contracted, and there are already contracts that are being shipped. However, unfortunately, at the moment, our production capacity and the amount we can contract are different figures. Hanna Hvozdar, Deputy Minister of Strategic Industry of Ukraine, in a comment to current time. Ukraine has put technology at the forefront of its military strategy, Forbes writes. After the start of Russia's full-scale invasion of Ukraine, many Ukrainian startups refocused on developing drones for the army's needs. The introduction of autonomous drones at the front line has become one of Ukraine's key breakthroughs in the application of artificial intelligence. According to Forbes, Kyiv already has UAVs that can track and destroy the enemy without human involvement. Ukraine has become a testing ground for the use of artificial intelligence in warfare, from autonomous drones to facial recognition algorithms designed to recognize perpetrators of war crimes. Much of this technology has been provided by Western companies, just as David triumphed over Goliath thanks to his technological advantage, the hope is that their support will give Ukraine an advantage over its far larger Russian opponent from Forbes publication. In 2023, the Ukrainian government invested about $1 billion in domestic drone production. During the year, 58 Ukrainian companies received state contracts, certified 67 drone models, and more than 200 companies involved in UAVs and related technologies are now operating in the market. Ukrainian naval drones are among the best in the world. The Ukrainian armed forces are also actively using drones in intercepting aerial targets, and now it has presented the new missile drones. Now the world market is in a bit of a shock because no one expected such a sharp breakthrough. Nevertheless, it should be said that Ukrainian engineers still have a lot of developments that can be implemented in the near future. We will surprise our Western partners and Russians many more times. Russia's war against Ukraine has demonstrated the importance of drones on the battlefield. According to Euractiv, 57 companies from NATO countries, as well as Germany, Spain, the UK, Sweden, Belgium and Israel, have begun testing new anti-drone systems. Reported by Anastasia Tarnavska, Nikita Skoblikov, UATV News.